how you doing? You come out on your Sunday afternoon to sit in the dark, we both say. <laughs> Community and variety are certainly alive and well in Colchester thanks to John O'Casson and the Warm and Toasty Club. On the 14th of October 2018, the Colchester Arts Centre was filled for a celebration of the Colchester Memory Afternoons, which are events dedicated to preserving and honouring the memories and experiences of people living in the region. The Memory Afternoons are a gathering of people over 65 who share their stories of what life was like when they were younger. It was an afternoon of eclectic celebration. After all, where else would you get to hear a ukulele band playing a cover of What's Up by Four Non Blondes? Music wasn't the only entertainment that afternoon, there was a gloriously intricate memory map of Colchester featuring many of the participants of the memory afternoons. There was a talk about the importance of recording and preserving local memories, hot buttered toast and a film celebrating one of the participants, as well as the ever popular and at times controversial debate on Biscuit of the Month, which this time around was won by the oft forgotten Lemon Puffs. Why don't you feature Lemon Puffs? Bring them on, bring on the Lemon Puffs! The audience was of course treated to some brilliant musical talent such as Emma Miller. And if that wasn't enough, we had Marina Florence performing some of her tracks, which were co-written by Jules Fox Allen, and inspired by some of the stories shared at the Memory Afternoons. And we also had A.D. Johnson, who took a break from his tour to play us some music. So much of what the Warm and Toasty Club does is about celebrating and preserving the memories of the older generation, but not in a ponderous manner, but one infused with laughter and entertainment. Whenever I see their name on a flyer or on the billing for an event, I know I will come away enriched and rejuvenated. But most of all, I know I'll just have a jolly good time. Thank you to everyone involved for such a wonderful afternoon at the Colchester Arts Centre.
Garibaldi had the only biscuit that came in a ration pack in the army. That's what it was. He still didn't win though, did he? He did, he won the war. He won the war instead. <laughs> what a great, great reply. He won the war instead. Our biscuit of the month can't really compete with that. <laughs>